Hello Chantal, this is a blast from the past for you, Craig McGregor. We worked together in 97, 98, I think it was, in Debenham Stockport. Some very happy memories uh, from that time. My favourite memory, I think, would be as a management team, we wanted to continue the tradition of the uh, Christmas festivities, which had to involve the management team putting on a bit of a show, a bit of a turn for the store team. We put all our efforts into it. I seem to recall you coordinated a lot of that, um, uh, that activity. Um, and we rehearsed for hours in the training room. I have no idea what was happening on the sales floor, what was happening to our customers, but we put on a really, really great show. Um, and I recall Steve Zandi um, dressed, in, um, dressed in drag, I recall. Anyway, happy memories. I wish you all the very, very best in your uh, new chapter. Um, be happy, be healthy, all the best. Hi Chantel, Lynn Johnson here. Um, I've heard you're retiring. Um, just wanted to take the opportunity to wish you well. Um, I've got really fond memories of our times together as sales managers. Um, I always think of you as a real force of nature. You always give yourself 100% to whatever you do, um, including the one woman dynamo that rang Altrincham Debenhams. Um, so I wish you all the very best for a long and happy retirement. I'm sure you've got some great plans that you want to follow through. So uh, take care of yourself and cheers. Bye. So it's finally happened. You're off. I can't believe it. Um, Chateau, I wish you all the best, sweetheart. It's Ad for me, R. Obviously, you've finally put a face to the voice. We've dealt with loads of cases over the years. Um, some difficult cases, some total one utter knobheads. Um, but I wish you all the best. You've been a pleasure. Always professional, always courteous, and above all, um, a good role model for everyone. So, all the best, sweetheart. Take care of yourself, and speak soon. Bye-bye. Hello, Chantal. Uh, this is Sergio, uh, the former uh, CEO at Debenhams. Uh, I've heard that uh, you're going to be leaving the, the Altrigan store and I just wanted to wish you uh, best of luck uh, for the next phase of, uh, of your life. I know that uh, you've given an awful lot of time to, uh, to this company. I visited, I think, your store about three times. I think you were one of the first stores that I visited. And to tell the truth, I think you had one of the biggest challenges in the whole of Debenhams uh, with that store. It was a very difficult store. But uh, if anything struck me when I was visiting you, is uh, how resilient you were and how determined you were to make sure that your store would be uh, moving forward. So thanks an awful lot for all your hard work and uh, enjoy uh, what co what's coming next. Okay, cheers, bye bye. Hi Chantal. So can you believe seven years ago you were my boss in Oldham. So the first time you met me, you came to the store to help with an incident before your actual start date and you came in to shitty sewage falling out of the ceiling and us all being covered in carry bags to stop ourselves from being covered in shite basically and that was the start of our many incidents together of which we could both fill multiple books and make millions from so don't know why we've not done that already it feels like a lifetime that i've known you and in that time you've been my store manager my colleague my counsellor many many times and most importantly, one of my, my closest friends. I have shared the funniest moments of my life with you, and in particular on our car share journeys that we have shared almost every day that I have gone to work or you've gone to work. And I don't know what I'm gonna do without them. Like literally the funniest moments of my life. Um, just one of them in particular, I can't give away too much information, because obviously we are in the CIA and I don't want anyone to know our secret information, but the concubine conversation has got to be the funniest moment of my life. I don't know what I'm gonna do when you go to Spain and I can't call you up on my way to work. I'm gonna miss you immensely. You have you mean so much to me, more than more than I could ever say. So Thank you very much for the last seven years and um, I can't wait for the next more than seven years with you. All the best of luck in your new journey. I love you to bits and I'll speak to you soon. Bye. Hey Chantal, it's only me. Just a little message to say um, bye, really. I can't believe you're leaving after all these years. Debenhams is not going to be the same without you, that's for sure. Um, what an absolute 
pleasure you have been to work with and just a thoroughly lovely human being and I'm going to miss you loads but I'm so so glad we're going to stay in touch through Facebook and I'm going to see all your crazy antics even though they won't be taking place at Debenhams anymore I'm sure Debenhams has enough <laughs> to last it another 200 years but anyway you're one special human and I love you lots and lots and lots and I hope you really really enjoy all the time you've got um, with, with your boys and just to enjoy life. So I love you lot, Chantal. Hope the next few months go well. Bye. Hi, Chantal. I just wanted to say good luck with everything in the future. I've been racking my brains trying to think of how many stores we've actually worked in together. And I think I got it to about five. Um, all the more enjoyable because I was working with you because you've always made it so much fun. Um, look after yourself. Take care. Bye. Hi, Chantal. I came to your rescue in Christmas 2011 and after passing some vital training in how to make the perfect cup of tea, you were stuck with me through 2012. There are way too many great times to mention, but to name a few, our freestyling ways, the day we smuggled weapons into court and Nicola's evacuation training are times that will stay with me forever. Debenham simply won't be the same without you and I hope we can stay in touch. Bye! Hi Chantal, it's Peter here. Just want to say I'm wishing you all the best for everything as you move on from Debenhams into your the next phase of your life, whether that be in France or uh, the south of Manchester or wherever life takes you. Um, when I think back about our time together, what do I think about? Firstly, you're always asking me what the gossip was, so um, wonder what the gossip is for you right now. Um, and then secondly, just you epitomise what it means to own your business. Uh, you took that little store that you've got and you absolutely made it your own. Um, and you were really an example to the rest of the business about how you work hard with what you've got to deliver the best you can. So look, that's my other phone going there in the background. Gonna have to go and do some work in my uh, new role with New Look. In the meantime, just wanna say massive congratulations on your early retirement. Uh, good luck with it and I'm sure we'll meet up soon to catch up on the gossip. Cheers, bye. Hi Chantel, <coughs> it's uh, Bob here. I've known you for donkey's years. Demons won't be the same uh, once you've gone. Uh, good luck with your 12 month plan for the next year. Bye for now. Hey girl, what can I say? It's the end of an era. We've opened stores and now we're closing your little shop. It's a sad day, but it's the start of something brilliant for you, I'm sure. We've had good times and we've had bad times. Lots of laughs and lots of tears. But I remember you on those numerous nights out when we've shared one too many glasses of vino. But as they say, what happened in Midlands West stays in Midlands West. I wish you every success, Chantel. I'll miss you. I know we've not spent a lot of time together over the recent years, but you will be very fond in my memories and stay in touch. Because if you don't stay in touch, you know I'll find you. Good luck, darling. Bye-bye. So, Chantel, I'm here with your old mate, Mrs. Bridges, who I know you've been humping around for years, um, and I know you're going to miss her just as much as I'm going to miss you. You are, for me, um, an original Debenhams legend. You have the most encyclopedic knowledge of everything to do with Debenhams and you're my go-to buddy um, whenever there's anything I don't know and you always have been actually for the last 10 years. Um, I count you and Sam as being my best Debenhams buddies. I can be a bit emotional um, and I am genuinely going to miss you. Some people think you're going off to enjoy the beaches of Spain um, Secretly, secretively, I think you're off to um, be a secret agent um, and put to use those amazing detective skills that you've got. All the best, Chantel, and I'm going to miss you. Hi, Chantel. I just wanted to wish you all the love and happiness with everything that you do. Um, you're going to leave a massive void in my work life. I've known you for 15 years. We've had lots of laughs, lots of tears. Good luck. Miss you. Hi, Chantel. 
uh, this is just a little bit of a message for you because it's your special day today, just to talk about a little bit of how we've worked in the past. It's many years since I worked with you in Stockport Dividends and I remember my first week when we had a conversation regarding you and your future and you made it very clear to me that you were only going to do 9 till 5 and go home, that's all you wanted. Well look at you now, you're now a store manager and not just a store manager, a great store manager. I also remember having a conversation with you about getting on with people and uh, particularly one person and I remember most people would say okay yep yeah, I'll do that not you you said I will try well I'm pleased to say Chantelle that you did try and you did succeed and since that day you've never stopped trying and hence the reason you are who you are today a big huge well done Chantelle you deserve everything Devonums are going to give you before you leave uh, a great send off because you've done nothing but give them commitment for the past 30 odd years. Uh, here's to camping and having drinks now and have a fab time today and between now and January. Hi Chantal, just wanted to send you a message to wish you all the best for the future. Debenhams is losing a literal living legend. I can't believe everything that you achieved and everything you've done over your time there. I wish you all the best. Please stay in touch and miss our chats. All the best. See ya. Chantal! October the 16th, 2006, I was born into Debenhams. Um, you did my introduction until training and that was that. I was hooked. I wanted to be just like you. But there is only one Chantelle pickup and I honestly don't think I could quite get away with calling a colleague rancid Fangita to their face. I worked for you for eight wonderful years across three stores until it was time for me to fly the nest and go and travel the world. So this is a thank you from me for being the best manager, friend and role model. Working for you and learning from you has made me the person that I am today. I also don't like sausage rolls anymore. I bleach everything and put everything through the dishwasher and I give everyone a stupid nickname. So enjoy your last Christmas at the cold face and I'll see you on the flip side. Right Chantelle. What can I say? It's been 11 years under your helm and it's been a roller coaster. We've cried, we've hugged, we've laughed, we've had you screaming like a banshee at us to get things right, but we've all come through the other outside on the alternate roller coaster that is. Uh, we've had good times, we have had bad times, but we still survived it all and it's been a pleasure to work with you. Oh, Leanne is thinking the same, but can't speak. <laughs> That's why she's here with me. And we are, as you know, I am the only one left of the original when we opened here when you came in 2008. So I'd like to say thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Hi Chantelle, it's your favourite Scouser here. Just want to wish you all the best of luck. It's been a pleasure working with you. You've been an amazing boss. Um, had some cracking laughs, we go back a long time in our days in Stockport, just wishing you all the best in the future. You hired me as a Christmas temp in 2006 at Debenhams in Stockport, coming to our department. It's fair to say I've been scared of you ever since. Over the years we have both worked in various different roles in different stars. We found ourselves working together again four and a half years ago when I became your visual supervisor at Debenhams Altrincham. There's been many ups and downs, but the good times definitely outweigh the bad. You have an excellent attention to detail that drives me mad, and for some reason you always end up being right. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank you for being more than just a store manager. 
In Debenhams Altrincham, you are part of the team and no job is too big or small. Sometimes it's, it's just best to let you do the merchandising so it's just right. I can't believe this is our last Christmas in the store we put so much hard work into. But I've got a feeling it's going to be the best Christmas yet. Maybe we will find ourselves working together in the future. One day I would love to tell you that I wear the badge now. But for now, I wish you every happiness in your adventures. Cheers for being a great role model and making my career at Debenham so fun. Well Chantelle, what can I say? Is it which nickname do I say? Which one am I today? Um, I could be Fanny, I could be Defaney, I could be Dependent. I can be what you want me to be. I can be your friend, which I am, outside of work. Um, but best of all, the minute I walked into Debenhams, we had that bond. We had that working relationship. Um, it went on and on until I became a supervisor. But most of all, it was the meeting you, what you give to everybody, what you still give to everybody, the best line manager anybody could have, the best store manager anybody could have, the love, the support, I speak for, I would say everybody. I don't think there's anybody out there who could say a wrong word about you. I'm just gonna wish you all the luck in the world and I'll see you soon. Take care.